Hello students, myself Ashish Chawla and today we discuss about cyclic quadrilateral. Cyclic quadrilateral. Now first of all we understood what do you mean by cyclic quadrilateral. Uh, a quadrilateral whose all the vertices lie on the circumference of the circle then the quadrilateral is said to be cyclic. अगर quadrilateral के सभी vertex circle की circumference पे अगर lie करेंगे तो उसे हम cyclic quadrilateral बोलेंगे. जैसे कि हम इस figure में देख रहे हैं कि यहाँ पे एक quadrilateral A, B, C, D है जिसके सभी vertex circle की circumference पे lie कर रहे हैं तो हम इसे cyclic quadrilateral बोलेंगे. So we can say that A, B, C, D is cyclic. Cyclic quadrilateral. A, B, C, D is a cyclic quadrilateral and the most important property of a cyclic quadrilateral is that the sum of its opposite angle is 180 degree the sum of the sum of the opposite angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is 180 degree of a cyclic cyclic quadrilateral is 180 degree let's see the proof of this uh, we have to prove that the sum of the opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral is 180 degree that is we have to prove that angle A plus angle C should be equal to 180 degree as well as angle B plus angle D should be equal to 180 degree so let's see the proof of this so let's see what we have given. We have given a, a cyclic quadrilateral. Let's say ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral, which is given to us. What we have given? We have given a cyclic quadrilateral. A cyclic quadrilateral. Cyclic quadrilateral ABC. Now what we have to prove? that the sum of the opposite angle is 180 degree that is angle A plus angle C equals to 180 degree and angle B plus angle D should be equals to 180 degree now to prove this we have to do some construction in the construction process what we have to do we simply connect AC and BD join AC and BD. Now let's say let's say this angle is one and let's say this angle is two. Now let's see the proof of it. Now we have to consider a triangle ADB. We have to consider triangle ADB and we apply the angle sum property that is angle A plus angle one plus angle two should be equals to 180 degree. Now let's say this angle C A C D is 3 and the angle A C B named as 4. Now from this figure we can say that the angle 1 is made by the arc A B and with the same arc angle 4 is formed. So we can say that angle 1 is equal to angle 4 because angle in the same segment are equal because these two angles are made by the same arc AB. So we can say that angle 1 is equals to angle 4. Reason angle in a same segment. Angle in a same segment. Same way the angle 2 is formed by the arc AD and the angle 3 is also made by the arc AD. So we can say that angle 2 and angle 3 are equal. Again the same reason that is angle in the same segment angle 2 is equals to angle 3 the reason is same that is angle in a same segment let's say this equation is 1 now in equation 1 from equation 1 from equation 1 we substitute in place of angle 1 we substitute 4 or in place of angle 2 we substitute angle 3 should be equals to 180 degree now 
as uh, from the figure we can say that angle 3 plus angle 4 is nothing but angle C angle 3 plus angle 4 is nothing but the angle C so we can say that angle A in place of 4 plus 3 we can write angle C equals to 180 degree so that we have to prove that is sum of the opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral is 180 degree in the same way we can prove in the same way in the same way we can prove angle B plus angle D is also equals to 180 degree now we move to the next theorem related to the cyclic quadrilateral that is the next theorem which is related to cyclic quadrilateral is that that the exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is equals to the interior opposite angle cyclic quadrilateral ka jo exterior angle hota hai wo uske interior opposite angle ki barabar hota let's see from the figure let's say we have a cyclic quadrilateral a b c d let's say we produce the side cd this is the exterior angle c exterior angle c of a cyclic quadrilateral so we have to show that the exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is equal to the interior opposite angle interior opposite means angle a so the exterior angle c is equal to angle a that we have to prove exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is equal to interior opposite angle so that is exterior angle C should be equals to angle A that we have to prove let's see how it is now first of all see what we have given we have given ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral and what we have to prove we have to prove that the exterior angle is equals to the interior opposite angle now to prove this as we know that ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral so we can say that angle A plus angle C is equals to 180 degree because it is a cyclic quadrilateral cyclic quadrilateral and from the figure we can say that ex uh, angle C plus exterior angle C is also equal to 180 degree but it form a linear pair angle C plus exterior angle C should be equal to 180 degree because it will form a linear pair linear pair now from these two equations that is first equation let's see and this is second equation from first and second equation as their right hand sides are equal so we can compare their left hand sides so the left hand side are also equal therefore angle A plus angle C should be equal to angle C plus exterior angle C now angle C and angle C are cancelled we left with angle A is equal to exterior angle C that we have to prove that the exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral is equal to the interior opposite angle in the same way we can prove for the other angles also thank you